Hey guys, it's uh, Corona Rush uh, day 500, uh, phase 3, day 10, and uh, uh, today uh, we're, we're, we're reporting uh, 172 cases, that's, that's too higher than uh, yesterday, uh, which uh, yesterday's uh, was uh, 170, okay. So, Toronto's still in the lead with uh, 48, uh, okay. 23 from uh, Peru region and uh, 11 from uh, Hamilton and 11 from uh, Durham region, okay. So that's uh, another double. So all other uh, regions are reported uh, un under uh, Ten, uh, two deaths have been reported today. <coughs> so, okay. Finally, they updated the uh, variant uh, cases uh, today. Okay. So, so UK variant is at 145,386 uh, and this uh, which is a increase uh, since uh, Friday the reporter actually. Yeah. South African variant is at uh, 1492. Brazilian variant is at uh, 5142. And uh, India variants is at uh, 3,913, okay. Still in uh, var variant uh, spot number three, or third of the uh, largest uh, variant threat, okay. So, vaccine vaccination uh, is uh, still uh, 12 and up. Uh, they haven't uh, changed anything uh, yet, no. So mRNA vaccines, uh, 28 days uh, since uh, your first shot. AstraZeneca vaccine, uh, 56 days uh, since your first shot. Uh, you can choose the vaccine and the location, time, date. Yeah, they uh, depend uh, very much, depending on your first uh, vaccination. Uh, and uh, and since a lot of people are getting vaccinated, it's going to be a take. It's going to be a, the wait time going to be take a lot take a lot of a long time actually. And uh, as uh, recommended by Halton uh, Region and Le Leeds Grenville Lanark Region, uh, you can, uh, please use the website uh, or the pharmacy because uh, there's going to be too many people calling. So oh, now. And uh, they. And uh, Halton Region, uh, they mentioned uh, if the, your internet service or email uh, is down, or email, if you don't have the email, call 311. So otherwise, don't call me 311. Because people have been calling 311 uh, for like they're trying to like sign up vaccines and they have an email and they and they have a good inter internet service.
So I got phase three down below. Okay. So I want to talk about that. Uh, Our topic today is uh, has to do with uh, international uh, passengers uh, entering uh, Canada. So they're separating uh, people uh, so, uh, so people coming in from the uh, from the USA or uh, another country uh, So they're basically uh, splitting you up. Uh, so uh, so if you're uh, fully vaccinated, like uh, you got both vaccine shots, so uh, you'll be put in one. Get, uh, uh, this um, not this line. And uh, if you are partially vaccinated, they will put you in the other line. So anyway, the, you still have to like uh, provide your uh, vaccine, uh, vaccination uh, proof. Uh, so, uh, uh, Because uh, it's uh, two different queues. Uh, this queue uh, is uh, vaccinated. Or if you haven't been vaccinated or partially vaccinated, like you want, you only got one, sh one vaccine shot. Yeah. So uh, you know, I'm I'm glad that like uh, Pearson Airport is uh, doing this. Uh, it was, a, it was a smart idea. And, uh, Cause if you just mix everyone everyone up, then like maybe someone could like uh, could get other people sick. And technically, if you're if you are traveling in, internationally into Can Canada, and uh, yeah, you gotta you know. You effectively are risking other people's lives uh, too, so... Uh. So, still, uh, you know... Of course, uh... You gotta like present a negative uh, coronavirus uh, test result. Uh, I believe I think you can do this uh, on the Arrive Can app, or uh, you can do it on uh, Canada.ca uh, on the website. Uh, you you can choose uh, which uh, method that uh, you want to use. Uh, and uh, Air Arrive Can the Arrive Can app. Uh, which is uh, available for download uh, on uh, Android, Apple, and Android. Uh, so, you know, free download. You no, know, yep. Just download and done. Just imp input uh, your uh, vaccine uh, information in. And, yeah. However, uh, if you want, like, uh, like, uh, Skip the fourteen-day uh, quarantine requirement. Uh, so uh, yeah, you have to be uh, 
fully fully vaccinated, you have to get both vaccine shots, and uh, two weeks uh, must pass, and then and then when you enter, yes, then you can, uh, yeah. You skip the quarantine, the two week uh, quarantine requirements. However, if you are like a uh, non, non uh, vaccine uh, vaccinated person, or if you partial uh, partially vaccinated, or if you uh, you got that both vaccine shots, but uh, two weeks haven't haven't passed. Sorry, you got a quarantine. And I know it's the rules are like so complicated, and, and yeah. But we gotta like have you know. Put safety first and uh mm -hmm. oh. mm -hmm. today it's a hospitalization they, they finally decided to show it okay and that uh 88 uh, people are hospitalized with the coronavirus, uh, okay? That, uh... Lower than last time, actually. One hundred twenty-seven ICU uh, pa patients. Uh, okay, and eighty-one uh, ICU patients are uh, using a ventilator. Uh -huh. Minus five. Okay. So, uh, however, they haven't not uh, updated uh, the long long term care home uh, that's uh, no. Anyway, uh, please don't follow coronavirus safety rules and regulations and phase three rules. Uh, uh, don't have a uh, large uh, gathering though over 25 uh, or just uh, or the safety of others it could get worse so sign up for vaccinations uh, if you haven't uh, I'm getting mine so anyways Stay safe. Let's hope uh, cases that uh, lighten up and uh, and it, it, it can be, uh, be more easier for international travel travelers to enter uh, and hopefully they're vaccinated. Stay safe.